Good morning everybody. It's a beautiful, beautiful day today. And as I'm sitting here in the garden and I'm just watching the sun rising and lighting the house. It happens now about 10 o'clock in the morning. So until 10 it is, oh, there is a little airplane, water plane. <laughs> Yeah, so it's quite fresh all morning long and then at 10 o'clock we have sunshine and then it will be moving through whole garden, it will be lovely. And as I'm sitting here, I'm thinking we have a very embarrassing luck of wisteria <laughs> on this facade. Our neighbors have beautiful wisteria. I'll try to zoom for you. Can you see this beautiful wisteria? And it's just, it's gorgeous. It is so beautiful. And I can see it on our front facade here. Growing from the ground there, on the arch, and going there, and around this toilet, and just just masking a little bit this corner. This is not really pretty. It is very plain wall. And it, it would be so beautiful with wisteria. Just so beautiful. Maybe in a few years, if it grows below these windows, it would have been amazing. I need to go to the garden center right now. Oh, I have to go to my neighbors and steal the whole wisteria. It's beautiful, I can't stop looking at it. And can you imagine on the sunshine in the spring grass? In winter we have no sunshine on this facade and it starts now, so it started one month ago and it's perfect. When the wisteria wakes up, it will wake up actually with the sunshine, with the spring. And then I can just imagine first thing in the morning all the bees are in the wisteria there on this sunny spot it will be marvelous it, it's perfect space for it just perfect coming back from our morning walk it's a very very typical scene cherry what's that okay <laughs> she's ready to go home straight away Now, the breakfast was wonderful, the garden is wonderful, the morning walk is wonderful and it is time to start our project and the guest bedroom it is. Let's see if we finish today the paneling. I really hope so. And to be honest, I expected it to be so much easier and quicker and yeah, it takes so much longer than I expected. It's just, it's a long time, it's, it takes a lot of time to cut the, the profiles, the frames, and it is actually very expensive. <laughs> I had no idea, even we use the cheapest wood, uh, raw wood, and Sergi works with his machines and makes it nice and beautiful. It is really expensive. So I'm not sure we will be doing any more panelings in the house and it takes such a long time and effort because the, the it's just it's so uneven the floor is uneven the walls are even well it's just right now when we install the skirting boards even though I did fill all the cracks and we tried to connect all the pieces of the skirting boards now I look at the skirting board and we have this not pretty gap in between the skirting board and the floor which I think we, we have to fill now because and there is no way we can cut the skirting board the way it it follows all the uh, imperfections on the floor <sighs> so you see what I mean very dark lane goes somewhere it's bigger somewhere it's actually fine but 
I think, yeah, and it will take a long time now to fill this gap and it's messy. <laughs> so, yeah, that has been challenging. And what is left to do first to clear everything <laughs> and then we are installing the last bit of the paneling, which is this upper border and one, one bit is done yesterday. We did it and it looks beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, this top border. So pretty. And we will continue with the top bit here. And I really hope we'll finish it today. Um, and also the corners, 10 centimeter corners. And then what will be left is the trim, wooden trim there. And we will be using the same one we did here this profile. I think it's ready. Said you already prepared the wood. Um, yeah, so this is plan for today. question is will we be able to do in one piece or we have to cut it so so we can well I think I can feel that bit there with the filler and I think this finishing nails I can put it here uh -huh. with angle uh -huh. so it, it will be hold for this little piece of wood okay. all together. Okay. Okay. It is really pretty. Now I started painting the everything, <laughs> just uh, finish coat and fixing all the little imperfections. And um, well, first I thought I would paint the skirting board and the molding, up, upper molding, top, top molding first before uh, gluing it into the place, but it is what it is and uh, masking tape works well. So here we are, painting, painting the board. And Sergi is fixing uh, the upholstery, trying to make it more or less, not in level, but the way it would uh, make less gap in between all the frames as the walls are wobbly like that. When we add a frame, you can see all the, all the gaps. <laughs> so he's trying to put little bits of wood to make it work. I don't know. 
know why, but she likes sitting there. <laughs> now when I'm talking, she knows I'm talking about her. Oh, little yoga, okay. Oh, well done. Well done, Shabby. Well done. still painting I'm still feeling all the holes and it still seems like a never-ending thing but I just wanted to show you said he's doing an amazing job with the with the border it's so pretty I love it just look at that it's so good absolutely beautiful Beautiful evening, beautiful dinner. We almost, almost, we haven't finished, we almost finished the paneling. Sherry is excited and I am extremely excited because we have the first scorpion. We have the first scorpion of this season. I know people told they've seen scorpions already in their houses. We didn't because we are in slightly cooler position. But here it is. Can you see the first scorpion? Here it is. Mr. Scorpion. That means it's summertime. <laughs> and it's wonderful. And this is it for today. And I wish you a very good day. And I see you tomorrow. Okay, Sergio now got very excited and he's trying to lighten up the scorpion so we all can see it better. First scorpion of the season. Okay, oh my goodness, you are definitely showing off. Oh, he's ready to attack. Did you see? Oh, okay. <gasps> wow, look at that. Wow, this is a huge difference. First scorpion of this season. Hooray! <laughs>